Live, local, late breaking. WPBF 25 News at 9 starts now. Well, if you know a student with an idea to make a positive impact on the community, this next segment is definitely for you. Next, the nonprofit Philanthropy Tank will be here in studio to share how they are inspiring the next generation of change makers. Welcome back. Philanthropy Tank is fueling and inspiring the next generation of change makers. And if you want to be part of this year's class, it's not too late to submit your project. Here to tell us more is the executive director, Amy Brand. Amy, thanks for being here. Thank you. And Elizabeth Pino, a former Philanthropy Tank winner. <laughs> and we have to start with the bell in the room, if you will. So, Elizabeth, tell us a little bit about your project. And I have a feeling it has to do with uh, this beautiful gown you're wearing. So I am a second year Palm Beach philanthropy finalist and my project is called Princesses Against Cancer and what we do is we go into hospitals and care facilities and surprise children battling cancer and other life-threatening illnesses. Oh my gosh that's wonderful. So tell us how your project actually started because you had to go through this entire process which is part of the philanthropy tank. Mm -hmm. So my story is a little bit different because I had my project already set up when I applied for Palm Beach Philanthropy. Um, I was doing birthday parties for a princess company and they asked me to go into a hospital and surprise a little girl that was battling cancer. Wow. And I thought that the company hadn't charged her, but they had actually charged the family over $200. So that's when I stepped in and I was like, there's no way that I'm going to let them keep doing this. I want to mm -hmm. start a project that's going to provide this service for free. And then I saw Palm Beach Philanthropy applications and I was like, this would be amazing because these costumes are so expensive and I'm so young, I need this guidance. I don't know what to do with my big idea. And that that's when awesome. they stepped in. And yep. That's, and it's taken off. And there's so many wonderful ideas like this and you get to go through all of them. So tell us about this this sure. process of someone's watching right now sure. thinking, sure. oh my gosh, my, my child, my grandchild has a wonderful idea and they yeah. could be able to, they could help. Well, we're looking for young leaders like Elizabeth mm -hmm. right now. Philanthropy Tank is a not-for-profit that looks for community service ideas that are impacting Palm Beach County. So whether you're interested in the environment or helping people with cancer or you're looking to help teach coding at, at for mm -hmm. at-risk teens, you can apply with your idea and actually we're taking applications right now through October 4th. So anyone who has an idea can submit that. If they are selected as a finalist, they have an opportunity to pitch their idea in front of our investors mm -hmm. at a live event at the Kravis Center and hopefully get the funding to implement their program. And you have probably seen so many wonderful ideas implemented over the last couple of years. It is amazing. The kids blow me away. Mm -hmm. um, they're really driven. They're really impacting the community. We've touched over 200,000 lives through what we've done with these students. And and it's all them. They're leading this project. They're just getting the support for the funding so that they can do what they want to do. Can you talk a little bit about the requirements as far as you know, the age requirements, yes. um, uh, how they can submit an application, where they can get an application? Absolutely. They can go to our website, which is philanthropytank.org. Mm -hmm. um, we're looking for students that are 8th through 12th grade. 8th through 12th grade, and, okay. Um, again, we're looking for vision, so something that addresses a need in Palm Beach County. We're looking for sustainability, that the program has some life to it. Like Elizabeth here, mm -hmm. she's in her fourth year of yeah. Princesses Against Cancer, serving the community and we're looking for them to also submit a short video sharing with us their idea or showing it in action. That's fantastic. So how many more days do they have in order to submit? I think we're counting down seven days. Seven days. <laughs> you have a week to submit your application. Thank you so much and we're lucky if you're our future. I think that you probably have yeah. to think that every time that a new class goes through. Absolutely. So inspiring. All the crazy things in this world and to see so many young people in our area doing really good things. So I'm sure you make more of a difference than you Aww, even know. Yeah, you, it's Pamela. wonderful. Yeah, and so can your kids or grandkids, <laughs> so take advantage of this. This is awesome. Philanthropy Tank applications, they're due October 4th. Um, you can help students build and grow this nonprofit. It's a great idea, so just go to the website right there, philanthropytank.org. We have information on our site too, wpbf.com. Now I want to see who wins this year too. I want to see all of the um, all the students back. So you'll March have, 19th. Okay, we'll invite <laughs> you back, so we want to hear all about it. All right, all right. thank you so thank much. You. We appreciate thank it. You. Brittley.